Boronic acids are versatile building blocks in organic chemistry, and they're used for a variety of transformations, including the asymmetric conjugate addition uh, to enones, as well as the Suzuki-Miara coupling reaction. And so one issue that's common in Suzuki-Miara coupling reactions is that the boronic acid is not stable enough to be used. And so uh, over the years, we've found a variety of solutions for this gen that generally mask the boronic acid in the form of pinnacle esters, mitoboronates, um, and a number of other structures. What the Rignotsky lab has uh, observed is that diethanolamine, a really cheap reagent, will complex to boronic acids and make them into air and water stable structures, uh, really crystalline, nice solids. And these uh, daboboronates, as we call them, can be used directly in suzuki miyara coupling reactions uh, if you use a protic solvent as part of your uh, reaction conditions. And so what I'll be showing you today is the really short, simple synthesis of a daboboronate for the synthesis of daboboronates, the first thing we'll do is put the boronic acid in the vial uh, with a stir bar. Then we'll add some methylene chloride, make it a nice uh, white solution. Next we'll add diethanolamine uh, by pipette. And what you'll see is the solid will go into solution and then it will come out as a precipitate and that's a dabble boronate. The daboboronate can then be filtered directly. It gives you a really nice white solid, and this can be used in Suzuki Miyara coupling. 